Yo, how's it going everybody? It is of course Undead Henderson back with a brand new GTA 5 clothing glitch actually. I haven't done one of these in probably a couple months. But I'm back with a brand new one showing you how to get the scuba gear on any outfit in GTA Online. It's pretty simple and pretty easy although it does involve the outfit transfer glitch. Which if you do not already know will delete all your saved outfits. So if you do not want that to happen, don't do this glitch. Although this is a pretty cool thing. You get the backpack and everything with it. But anyways, to get this, you want to go into your interaction menu first. And make sure you have on the outfit that you want to get it on. Once you have that, go into your pause menu and you want to go to swap character. Once you're in swap character, you want to go over and create a new female character if you do not already have one. But you're going to need to delete them later on just so you know. Once you have your character... Load into a GTA Online lobby and go to any clothing store. Once you get to the clothing store, you want to make the same outfit as I have here by going to the tops. You want to go to the sports jackets and you want to get the sea green puffer jacket. Once you have that, go all the way down to the tank tops. And you want to get the white Jolly Roger T or tank, whatever. Once you have both of those, go over to the pants. You want to go into sports pants and get the spied muscle pants. This is kind of like the merge component. Same with the shoes. You want to go to the sneakers and get the pink plain high tops. Now finally head over to the accessories. You want to go into gloves and get the light woodland tactical gloves. That's another merge component if you do not already know. And now finally you want to put on the heavy armor. This one right here. Once you have all that go ahead and save the outfit. And if you want you can go ahead and make any other outfits for my videos as well. So you can have multiple at once. But once you have done this you just want to go ahead and kill yourself like always. Once you're dead and come back to life you just want to open up your pause menu going to online. And go to creator mode. Once you've landed in the creator mode. You just want to go ahead and load up any random race that you have. Make sure it's decently long. I don't know the exact requirements. But once you have it. Just go ahead and test it out. Once the test is completed, push OK, and as soon as you load back into creator mode, you want to open up your pause menu, go to online, and go to choose character. You don't want to do that pretty quick, by the way, too. Once you're back into the choose character menu, just go over and delete your female character from existence. She does not matter. Get her out of here. And once she's gone and out of the way, as soon as the characters load back in, you want to back out into story mode. Now once you have made it into story mode as Michael bitches at this guy You just want to go back right into GTA Online It can be a public lobby, private, doesn't really matter Once you made it back there Make sure your outfit is ready to go for the glitch Whatever outfit, if you want to put changes on it, whatever it be As you can see that the outfit is saved, the one outfit that we made Once your outfit is complete, you just want to open up your pause menu, go into online, go to jobs, and you want to go into versus missions, and you want to put on the versus mission crooked cop. Once you load into the job, you want to make sure the clothing is set to player owned, whether you're the host or not, if not, just back out and rejoin the job. And then once you've loaded in, you just want to switch it over to the one outfit and you should see that the scuba gear does glitch onto your outfit. Now just load in and you want to go into your interaction menu, put on an earpiece, and then just quit out of the job. Simple as that. You don't have to be fast or anything, just get it done. And afterwards you should load back into online with the same outfit, with the scuba gear and everything attached. And as you can see here, the outfit is completed. Now I can go ahead and change up whatever I want other than the clothing, but I can put on a different mask, a different hat, glasses, whatever. 
depending on your head. You can even put on a parachute underneath the scuba suit backpack, whatever you want to do. It doesn't really matter, make it your own. I went ahead and made a pretty cool looking outfit in my opinion using the hat mask glitch with the telescope with the yellow mandible mask and the yellow construction hat. You can go ahead and copy that if you want, it doesn't matter, or make something all your own. But anyways, that's it for this video guys. I hope you enjoy this glitch and make some bomber looking outfits with it. That is it for me. I'm Undead Henderson. Make sure you like and subscribe if you want to, it doesn't matter, but I am out of here. Peace out.